What's going on guys? Welcome back to Crusader Kings 3 here on part 5 of our Viking adventures. We do have a new dynasty legacy to do, so we're going to go ahead and go with the first one in blood here. For noble veins. I honestly, like, getting that consecrated bloodline is just so good for the, of course, the popularity and everything else that goes along with it. Or I guess I should say, like, the opinion and everything. Um, so I was thinking maybe, like, oh, we'll go insular and then convert... Holy sites would be right here. We'd be good to go, you know, but I was like, you know what? Let's just stay what our faith is and let's take our holy sites. So we need to take Jorvik and I'll take these other two as well. This one's held by the Russians and this one is held by another uh, Viking. Paderborn over here would be nice, but that's a big imp or country right now that I don't really want to mess with. We could probably do it, but it'd be messy. This is a lot easier. And I'm trying to think where I want to set my sons up. I'm thinking maybe making one the King of Wales over here or having them kind of come over here and, and set up. Let's look at the kingdom titles here. We have Norway and Sweden. Um, I don't really want to convert these to my culture because they're just the development is so low and it's so bad. We always have the option, of course, to reform our culture yet again um, later, but we'll have to see how it goes. So first and foremost, I think we should probably go ahead and take um, the... Um, Yardum of Jorvik over here. So if we declare war, conquer duchy. And then the Jarldom of Jorvik, we could see here. We gain that territory, our allies over here. And now I do want to show you, this is weird, and I'm not sure why it does this. Um, So like if we say like over here and we declare war on him and we do conquer duchy and the duchy of East Anglia, right? Which is right here. These guys are vassalized. And I'm not sure why. Is it because they're Norse as well? Like, it doesn't really explain. So I'm not sure why why that's the case. Because I don't want to vassalize these guys because they're not really any good. I'd rather them be gone. So anyway, let's get started. Uh, speaking of that, real quick, let's take a look at our mercenary. Oh, yeah, not mercenaries, our men-at-arms. We need to station this someplace. Uh, right not. Okay. And then that's still going to be updating. And we need to increase that. We Hopefully we'll get some more war. War. More money in the war. So let's... Uh, I'm not going to wait to increase our men in arms. Because I think there's already a war going on. There is. There's already a war going on over here. So... Let's go ahead. Take Jorvik. Conquer Duchy. Jorvik. That's going to be West Riding, North Riding, East, and Lincolnshire. So I guess that's maybe it works similar to how, um, did I do raise all? Bet you I did. Yep. That is not what we want. Let's merge. Now. Yeah, we're going to split off. <laughs> that was not what we wanted. Wish there was a way to just uh, get rid of all levies automatically. Okay, so we can't disband them yet. That seems about right. 153 levies is okay. Well, there's not going to be hostile army around in very soon. There we go. Now we get suddenly we went from minus five, minus 0.5 to that. Ivar wants to marry my daughter. Yeah, I'm going to decline that, buddy. Considering we're literally at war right now. Oh, real quick. I want to actually, uh, we're going to dismiss you and you. These two concubines, like, they have no. No ally to him and no thing. So she has beautiful and fecund. Or fecund. I don't know how you'd say it, but either one. We should wipe the floor with them decently. Okay, it wasn't a complete slaughter, but we did wipe them out pretty good. We do need to take Lincolnshire up there. Excellent. Now, since we are the culture head, we'll go ahead and take that one right now. We are working on Ledger, I believe it was. Yep. 
Okay, we took that. They're trying to reinforce. Which we don't want either. Oh, we didn't catch them. Interesting. Okay, well, we won that war. That was pretty quick. Okay. Excellent. So we took took all of that. Dismiss that. Now, I did want to... We really didn't get any gold out of that. Oh, we're still at war with them. Okay. Um, guess we just have to come and beat the crap out of them, huh? Is this an enemy army? It is. I don't think we'll catch them. Because they're going to set sail. Nope. Well, we could deal with these guys, I guess. Now they're going to try to go back here and take Lincoln, I guess. Let's head back down. Yep. Okay. We want to be sponsored. Very competent. Regalia, sure, because I have like nothing. Uh, let's actually have this guy convert. You might not. Now I wanted to actually set my son up to be like I said a king, but um, did we slaughter him? We did. Not too good though. Don't run. Come back and take your beatings. Okay, we caught another one. Oh, we got the banner. We will take it and put it on the wall. Because uh, we have nothing. <laughs> there we go. Just chase him down. Don't want him to regroup back. And if we can get him by themselves, that'd be nice. Oh, they're going to group up. Okay, highest quality. 80 gold, higher quality. Oh, we don't really have the money. Oh, he's a champion of mine. He converted. All right. Yeah. Well, we got to take some stuff. Oh, we caught one of them. We got another banner. <laughs> Small lander banner. All right, we'll have to take a look at that one. Okay, let's see. We have <laughs> three banners. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> okay, I, mean, I guess beating the daylights out of them enough was uh, enough to win the war without having to take anything. Uh, we also have a 10% for that. All right, thank you. And they paid us gold as well. Now, can we... Can't switch to raiding. Let's go ahead, disband. And, uh... Well, we can hold court. Let's do that. Let's see if we get something good. Okay, young man in tow. My acquaintance. Westeran Erickson. Okay, so he's not a server of retinue champions. Uh, yeah. Yeah, that's that's pretty dang good. Um, I can make it my bodyguard. I'll make him that for now. There we go. Countess here. She's 86 with zero prowess. Okay. Liege of the right to Earl of Malinzi, no matter what anyone else will say. Uh, I'll battle you for it. <laughs> okay. Okay. No increase, low increase. Um, 
wait and hope. <laughs> okay. Dual handicap rank four. We win. I mean, she's a shield maiden, I guess, but she's 86, man. <laughs> I mean, I'm old too, but dang, I'm 71. At least I still have six prowess. <laughs> Beat the crap out of her. Whoops. My guest approaches the throne with a smirk on her face. Greeting your majesty. A recent trip to Lordship of Gwent. Okay. Yeah, I don't really care. Yep, we'll take the court grandeur. Okay, we're at 10 to 6. So I need... I don't have, like, family. Like, a ton of family. I would like to set them up, but you know what? Fine. Um... Let's find you a spouse first. Let's look at traits inheritable. Here we go. She's intelligent. That'll work. All right, I'm going to make him. Here, you can have all of this. There you go, big guy. Your brother will probably be a king, though. And I think, actually, I can... Yeah, make him my alliance. Okay. Marriage. Excellent. Let's look here. What? How much can we do with our military right now? We need... A lot of gold. Who can I raid? Uh, actually, real quick as well. Let's look at control. Yeah, let's let's increase Kent. Two years on Kent. Okay. I think everybody... Oh, you suck. Let's see if we got... 16. Yep, that works. It's a little better. Since we're unreformed and everybody else is like reformed and all this other stuff, it's it's kind of a like it's like years to basically convert them. If you think about it, like, you know. Let's look at factions. Okay, this is another reason too. Like I'm worried about leaving. So we got these guys over here. I am converting this guy. Or not, I'm swaying him. Um but yeah, he's Catholic Anglo Saxon, he does not does not like me. This guy does not either. And then... Yeah. Okay. Oh, they can't. Oh, okay. If we put it here, we can do... Um... We could raise men at arms and then switch to raiding. So let's raise. Amanda promoted. I guess. You're not really good, man. Yeah, get out of here. All right, we're going to split in half. Then start raiding. Where can we raid? Gold, five. Oh, we'll start here, I guess, and work our way up. Rating as well. Okay, my son had a daughter. Elva, that's good. What is your... She's intelligent. You know, that tells me she's probably a bastard. Because she's only in quick. Okay, betrothed can marry. Good. So I wonder, <laughs> can I, can I not, uh, does he have like a truce? Here's his liege. Can I not, uh, I guess I can't raid him if he has a truce. Yeah. All right, well. Okay, my other son has come of age. He's a psychotic, elusive shadow. Uh, 
Um. Well, let's see here. 50 opinion. You can take the free opinion. Why not? Can I... Are you... Who are you? My prisoner. Oland. Okay, well. There you go. Yeah, it looks like we can't raid anybody. We have a truce on. Makes sense. We can raid Ivar up here. Which we shall. Okay, now let's take a look here at our prisoners. Brody. You have money of 100 something gold. Look at that. 100 gold, man. All right. Earl, 50 gold. Thank you. And this guy. He's a berserker. He's all of that. I mean, do you want to come join me? Lonely doll. Excellent. We have our regular regalia. It's not very good, but it'll work. Masterwork. I take that back. Something. Considering we have nothing. We have money though. All right, let's um increase here. Twice. That'll put them at four out of five. wonder if Ivar is going to come and say hi. Yeah, why am I? No idea why it's doing the whole uh, you're going to vassalize them instead of take the territory. I guess it's because they are. We're going to have to wait then. All right. We'll take the uh, skilled slaves. For 30 gold. I will take the skilled slaves. It's just, it buffs uh, our capital. So you see, we went from like five years to 14 months. Oh. Yir. Okay. Give it to Yir. You rated this one already? You have. At 55 out of 60. All right, march back then. Okay, good. All right. We'll head back. Let's see what we have here. Okay, so four to five. We just got to let them build up. Let's go ahead and disband. There we go. We'll let them build up. And once they build up, we're going to come up here and take this. Because if we do that one. All right. Somebody's trying to kill him. Quite satisfied. Okay, that's fine. You can be content. I don't vassalize anybody. Okay, we're going to go up here and take that one as soon as we get a few more. Uh oh, okay. Well, hopefully we get something good. We're getting kind of old 73 man banging out children, literally. These guys are still fighting. So activities, okay. And then what that we have. Uh oh, child was not meant to be. Well, that's okay. Now let's look intrigue. We're swaying this guy. There's no point to it. Now. Who are you? 
sway him. I don't want to just convert. I don't want him to convert. I don't want any of these guys to convert because I'm hoping when I do my new religion that I can just take their stuff. Which is what I plan on doing. All right, we'll just leave them angry. Let them, if they rise up, well, you know what's going to happen. Agents at court. Okay. This guy. Ah. Okay. Let's get ready to rush. We're going to go ahead and do this over here. Go there. Do that one. And then these guys, they should be quite inferior to us. We want not county. We want the duchy. And this one over here is what holds the um what holds the uh just the religious site. So I'm gonna raise all men at arms. Then I'm gonna raise local. Okay, he comes in. Thank you for your generous gift. Okay, let's, uh, split in half. And then, yeah, that did not work how I wanted it to. Okay, well, let's just do this then. Split off new army, Huskarls, Vanguardians, Earl, Levies. We'll do the same again. I think we should be good, probably, with that many levies. Okay, 2,000. Yeah, 1,000 levies should be decent. We're going to sell right up to... I don't really want that disembarkation bonus. Uh, bonus. It's definitely not a bonus. We're going to sell right over there. Let's see what we actually will sell to right here and see what we get. Okay, the Dissolution Faction. That's good. So if they're over there, we'll just disembark. Right there. This is all mountainous. Oh yeah, we don't want to sway that guy. Um, who's on my crew that needs to be swayed? Sway you. I also do Learn Language. Okay. We can take this. Wait for our disembar disembarkation bonus to go away. Excellent. New perk. Plan cultivation. Give that a bonus. Okay. They have... He has finished doing the control. Let's see what other control that we own. Let's see. Um... We'll do that one. I'd rather do commanders promoted, but I kind of getting tired of having to worry about getting tackled every time I leave. Now oh, they're trying to run. I'll do that. He became a berserker. Fantastic. All right, we slaughtered him. It was half their army. Set and sail with ninety three percent. We're going to take this pretty quickly. I mean, the development is one. But keep this out of... I don't want this. <laughs> okay, thank you. <laughs> We're just going to do that. All right. Excellent. Okay, so now we own that. Now we can swoop down and take this from Novogrod. Um, and then we should be on the way to reforming. But... Yeah, this area... I was going to give this to my kid. 
But this this place is trash. <laughs> I don't want it. The development is so low. Um, I'm worried about them converting to being uh so if we were to like grant this to a local Norris noble which would probably be good so they could stay over here and do what they do. Okay, they have a higher opinion of me, but should be fine. Yeah, I was going to set my son up to be like the king over here, but this is... Uh, let's see. Because he's Anglo-Nordic. Um... And I could set him up as the king of Sweden. I, that should work. Oh, he's, man, he's a beast. So. All right. Here you go. One, two, three. There we go. That's all that. Okay. Yeah, that should work. Now, before, let's find him a spouse. He is strong and calm, calmly, only. Do we have somebody else who is strong? No, I saw some hail though. Traits inheritable. Let's see. She's 23, commoner. 32. Ugh. This is the hard part. Maximum age. 25. Okay. Oh, here we go. Anglo Nordic. She's comely. He's comely, I think. Yep. Well, that'll work. And one, two, three. There you go. Okay, so even if we were going to do anything else, we don't have any. Uh, there's not many money up here worth raiding. Yeah, it's, it's probably one gold, seven gold. I guess better than I thought. Okay, so now we have two. We gotta have one more, I believe. Get rid of that dang white color over there. Um, but yeah, so. If you're not familiar with custom religions in this game, they are quite good. So let's take a look here. We want this one. So, uh, duchy. No, nope. oh, upland. Yep, we want upland. It's one, two, three. Um, these over here. Yeah, they're gonna. We're gonna smash them. Okay. Uh, let's see here. We don't want to sail. We could probably march it, I guess. Might actually be quicker to sail. I don't know. We're just going to raise men at arms. Man, they're so bad that... Okay, it is it is a march. All right, let's march to there and meet up then. We're gonna march straight down to the war target. I made that mistake before, of like, of uh, wondering why my war score was going down. What's this? Oh, my son, yeah. And I was like, why is my war score going down? Well, the problem being is that, uh, yeah, we did not do that correctly. Okay. So let's look at the duchy. All right. Pause that. My other son, guess what? Guess where you're going, buddy? Oh, wait, that's you up here. Never mind. Okay, so upland. Yeah, one, two. Yeah. Okay, so they're gonna we're going to march down. Granger's going up and down. We can create some of those. We can create an accolade. Okay, we can usurp that. 
from this guy. 250. I'm um, kind of good. It doesn't really matter too much because we own the whole thing. Okay, my son had another daughter. Now she's good as well. Van Hilde. The next generation is starting to look fun. All right, we're going to march down here. Okay, we're going to try again. Now, who can I give this to? You're good, you're good. Can I give it to you? No. Nope. Well, that's fine, I guess. Maybe I can find a good spouse for my daughter here, who's not too bad. Being Norse is fine. Let's see here. Maybe matrilinearly. Stigger. Somebody steward. Um, you're kind of trash. You're pretty good, especially for intrigue. Okay. Excellent. Yeah, you're going to hold, uh, we'll pin you. You're going to hold Upland here soon. Speaking of that, let's see. Okay, you are. Well, that was easy. Who did we capture? <laughs> Nobody. We just destroyed their army. Okay, that works. Then. Thank you. Okay, now we can reform... Excellent. All right, so let's give this away. Um, we're just going to disband. Go home. And then... Yeah, what do we... Yeah, we slaughtered him to the man, basically. We can raise a rune stone. Don't even know who that kid is. But yes, let's do it. Upland Reckless Devon. Um, Conquest. Where is that? Hmm. It's going to Devon. Okay. So. You. Can have this and this. Congratulations. With my daughter. I'm going to make you the king of Smallland, basically. You're pretty dang good as well. 26. Intrigue. He's going to die soon, I think. 56. You're not even a vassal, or you are. Um, I don't really want to piss him off being, <laughs> being that high of uh, intrigue. He's going to try to kill me, probably. Yeah, I don't really want to change his contract. Because then they get all mad later. Especially my kids. Declare a ton of wars now. Let's see here. So if we look at this. Okay, guys. It looks like we're reaching time on part five. You know where part six is going to pick up? We're going to reform this religion, baby. And we're going to... And that's when things are going to start rolling. Because if these Catholics don't automatically convert... Oh, I'm revoking all their titles. And it's going to help me clean up so much. Um... But yeah, and then we'll start. We'll probably take this over. I want to try to keep this out of my culture. That way uh, they can do their own thing and have fun with all that. And I can have my nice development over here of my own Anglo Nordic culture, which is just these basically. So not too bad. All right, guys, thanks for watching. Next one is going to be a fun one. Hopefully we'll be cleaning up here and uh, managing our realm a little better with our brand new religion. And it's going to be a fun one. I'm, I'm excited. I've been thinking about what to make it. So I'll see you back here for part six.